Yeah, Giovanna, they are still searching for that suspect tonight. Meanwhile, the victim is stable, but he is in critical condition. Horrified travelers at the downtown Riverside Metrolink station move aside as a stabbing suspect runs past them. Just moments before, police say this man stabbed a stranger in the throat. Katrina says she was dropping her friend off at the station when he was stabbed on the platform. And then they came running, and I was like, what's going on? I've seen the suspect. To almost fall. Chilling surveillance video shows the suspect running away from the scene and the victim walking calmly back to Katrina's car. He was holding his neck like this and I seen blood coming out all down on his clothes and everything. So I got him and brought him over to the car and trying to put the towels and stuff to keep the blood in as much as I could. Katrina says her friend slid down the side of her car and was passing out while she was on the phone with 911. This while he was on the phone with his brother saying his goodbyes. And he was saying, I'm not going to make it, Odell. I'm not going to make it. And I said, yes, you are, Albert. You are. You are. Police believe the suspect is a man in his late 20s and possibly a transient. We believe that the uh, attack on the victim was completely unprovoked. Um, we don't don't believe that the suspect and, and victim uh, knew each other at all. Police say there's still no sign of the suspect. He took off running north along the train tracks. Doreen Giovanna, the Metrolink service from this platform here in downtown Riverside has been closed today, but it will be open for travelers starting tomorrow morning. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.